The Treehouse Club Scary Movie Night, 2. Alright guys. Cooper and I talked this over the past week. He says it would be a great idea to actually host a scary movie night every year in the month of October. Oh, so it's gonna become like some sort of tradition? Yup. Is that right, Cooper? You know what movie we're screening? What's with the gestures? Are you okay? Cooper has laryngitis. He's had a pretty bad cold the past week, and it has affected his voice box. Holy moly, really? It's too much for me to help you host tonight. Don't try to speak. That will make it worse. You should try drinking some warm tea, with lemon and honey. There's no evidence that could help. Don't whisper either. Just rest your voice, and don't talk. Anyways, our horror movie tonight is gonna be Scream. Oh, is that the movie with Jenna Ortega? Not that one. That one is the reboot that released in 2022. We're watching the original with Nev Campbell. Cooper and Mia, is it okay if I pass on this movie? Mom still allows me to watch scary movies. But I usually get scared of that ghost face mask. Oh yeah, guys. That leads me to my next point. Mom doesn't want me and Emma to watch scary movies yet, because we're obviously too young. Is there anything you can do for us three? I suppose we could put a movie on for you three, inside. Mom and Dad aren't home so you can use the TV in the living room. Anybody got an age-appropriate Halloween movie, for Brian, Emma and Cameron? Hocus Pocus? Perfect. It's PG, that should be okay. Great. Mom allows us to watch that. You guys come with me. For the rest of you, let's roll film. It's on HBO Max, just like it. Alright. Time for some jump scares, tension, and murders. Marcus. I just hope you don't do what you did last year when you screamed like a goat and fell onto me. That was just plain disgusting. You better not do that with Melody. It was just a reaction. But that was over a year ago. I'm not sure now. Boss, rectangle shade. Angela and Bree, I'll get you guys some popcorn. Do you guys want to watch the first one? Or Hocus Pocus 2? First. 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 I thought so. No, please. No. Not Billy. No. That's right, Sydney. Run, run, run. Yes, block the doorway with a surfboard. Climb out the window. No, no, no. Ghost face made it to the window. Ah, uh, buddy. Can you get off, my girlfriend? Yeah. You. Do you wear deodorant? Your armpits smell like onions. I'm sorry, Rachel. I'm usually sensitive to jump scares. It's only a movie. Mature now, huh? Huh? 
Hi. Hello. Not to be inappropriate, but I kinda like you. Oh. So all of that chaos wouldn't have happened if Max didn't light the black flame candle that brought back the Sanderson sisters. Good movie. It kinda makes me wanna watch the second one. Movie over? Yep. You guys were right. You wouldn't have liked the movie. So much murders and jumps caring. Hocus Pocus was a better choice for you three. Did Max and Allison kiss? They almost did. Speaking of kissing, we should have announced this before the screening. Me and Keegan finally kissed at the fair last week. No way. Keegan, how did that feel for you? It felt romantic. I didn't feel uncomfortable at all. It was a tiny bit strange for me. I never kissed anybody before in my life. Besides my parents, before bedtime. I am so proud of you too. Come again? I am really proud of you too. Cooper, we really can't hear you, buddy. What did we say about talking? Don't. You need to rest your voice. He said he's really proud of you and Daniel for taking a step forward. Oh. Well, we're happy to hear that. Thanks. And yeah, rest that voice. A treatment that should help for that is breathing steam in the shower. Man, tonight was fun. I hope we can do this again next year. Well, if this video makes great success, somebody in the comment section might request another sequel. And CCTA will do it.